The 8BitDo02 controller doesn't have a dedicated reset button, so we'll use specific button combinations to troubleshoot connection issues. First, make sure your controller is fully charged. Connect it via USB cable and allow it to charge completely before troubleshooting. To power cycle the controller, hold the start button for three seconds for normal shutdown. If the controller is frozen or unresponsive, hold the start button for eight seconds to force shutdown. Put the controller into pairing mode by holding the select button for three seconds. You'll know it's in pairing mode when the LED starts flashing rapidly. On your device, go to Bluetooth settings and search for available devices. Look for 8BitDo02 in the list and select it to begin pairing. When connecting to an iPad or other iOS device, you may be prompted to enter a PIN. Simply enter four zeros, zero, 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 zero. If your controller pairs with a PC, but then immediately disconnects, try unpairing it from Bluetooth settings, restart the Bluetooth service, and then pair it again. Finally, make sure your controller firmware is up to date using the 8BitDo Ultimate software. Connect via USB, download the software, and install any available firmware updates to resolve compatibility issues. When basic troubleshooting fails, a factory reset can resolve persistent connection issues with your 8BitDo02 controller. First, ensure your controller is completely turned off before beginning the factory reset process. Now press and hold the L button, R button, and Start button simultaneously. While holding these three buttons, also press the pairing button located on the back of the controller. Continue holding all four buttons for approximately eight seconds until the LED light blinks rapidly, then stops and turns off completely. This indicates the factory reset is complete. If the factory reset doesn't solve your issue, try connecting in different controller modes. Each mode is designed for specific devices and platforms. To enter X input mode for Windows PCs, hold X plus start while turning on the controller. For other platforms, try different button combinations with start. Another useful solution is resetting the D-pad mapping. Hold up on the D-pad plus select for five seconds to restore default D-pad functionality. Keep in mind that the controller has automatic shutdown features. It will turn off if not connected within one minute or if there's no input for 15 minutes during use. If these solutions don't resolve your connection issues, contact 8BitDo support for further assistance. They can provide additional troubleshooting steps or warranty service if needed.